Cheers. Oh, you're an early bird. Well, I am paid to catch the worm. You caught my attackers yet? Not yet. But I believe you've been discharged. Yeah, well, I'm just waiting for a taxi, unless you want to give me a lift home. I can give you a lift to the station. Why? Because your wife has made accusations of domestic abuse. <laughs> oh, she's lying. We can talk about that at the station. When I said I was mugged yesterday, I lied. It was her. She attacked me, but I have never hurt her. Never. Thomas King, you are under arrest for coercive and controlling behaviour and assault. You don't have to say anything, but it may harm your defence if you do not mention, when questioned, something you later rely on in court. Do you understand? In your statement yesterday, you said that you were mugged by persons unknown. <clears throat> but earlier at the hospital, you said... When I said I was mugged yesterday, I lied. It was her. She attacked me. So which is the truth? I was attacked by my wife, Belle King, with an axe, at her family home at the flat at the back. For your information, Mrs King has admitted to the attack and handed in the weapon. Right. So what's going to happen to her? That's to be decided. You were very believable yesterday when you lied. So why lie? I was defending my wife. Believe it or not, I still care for her. Her illness, it makes her act irrationally. It makes her do and say things that she doesn't really mean. How did her irrational behavior manifest when the two of you were together? Her mood is always up and down. I never know which bell I'm coming home to. She's angry all the time. She calls me names, says that I'm useless and ugly, evil. Did it ever get physical between you? She'd smash things down in front of me. She'd throw things at me, the remote control, other things. She pushed me around. Once in the street, in front of her family. And yeah, she hit me. But she was always sorry after. She was always really sorry. Were you ever violent towards her, apart from during the attack? I think. Once I bruised her and I was forced to restrain her, but I was defending myself. I never hit her, never. I don't know why she is saying all that because it's her, it's all her. Mr. King, is everything you've just told me another lie? No. Why? Did you strike a deal with your wife yesterday? A deal? Mrs King claims that you asked her not to report the abuse, and in return, you wouldn't report the attack. She was the one that begged me not to report the attack, and I was scared of what she'd do if I did. Why would she ask you to lie and then come to us with allegations of abuse? I've no idea. Maybe she felt that I was still going to report her. And were you? I don't know. I was confused. This is what she does to me. I don't know how to respond to her, how to make her happy. I am always scared of her. Mr King, have you ever heard of a screwhead camera? Yeah. I'm showing Mr King evidence A14. And Mrs. King claims that you installed this and several others in your house. Yeah, I did. 
but only one downstairs. Was she aware of it? No. So why did you do it? Did she tell you how she almost burned our house down? No, because she did. I installed it to keep her safe. You've never heard of a smoke detector? Have you ever lived with someone that has mental health episodes? You're always scared that they're gonna hurt themselves. Okay, fine. I probably should have told her, but I did it for the right reasons. Did you keep any of the footage? No. Why? Well, it would be useful to see some examples of abuse. <sighs> I didn't even think of that. It deletes itself after 24 hours. Well, that's a shame, because in cases like these, we need to seize your electronics. So if you could provide us with a list of all your devices, laptops, tablets, anything. Sure. I'll ask my uncle to bring everything in. No, that's not how it works, I'm afraid. See, we need the list to cross-reference against what the police will find. And I believe that they're in your house right now. I couldn't say anything. Been in there for ages. They won't go to all this trouble if they weren't taking it seriously. Thanks for cooperating. Did you get through to the station? Somebody's phoning me back. They will. Please try not to worry. Are you intent on completely ruining his life? He gets mugged, and you do this. Jimmy, this isn't helping anyone. Why now, Belle? Oh, good God. What? It was me feeling bad about accusing you. He wasn't mugged, was he? You did it. It was self-defence. Your precious nephew is an abuser. And how convenient that she tells the police that now, after she's nearly chopped him in half. It won't work, Bell. The truth will come out. I hope it does. And then you will be sorry. Claire, no. Thanks. How you doing? Oh, you know, living my best life. Oh. Did the police say what they took from the house? I asked, but they won't say until it's all been logged. What? They didn't mention anything about a tablet? In a zombie case? Zombies? There's a spare case from Elliot, my cousin. Is there anything you want to tell me? Can I speak to you as a mate, not my solicitor? Sure. There is still some footage on the tablet. You said it deleted itself. So you have got Bell abusing you? No. I deleted all that. So what have you kept? Just random things, probably. Uh, brewing up a hundred times. Whatever set the cameras off, I've no idea. You mean camera? Yeah. Okay, so there might be more than one. Right. What does right mean? The police are looking for any evidence of controlling behavior. It sounds like this footage might add weight to her claim. You should not have lied to the police. I know. Okay. I'll ask them again. A tablet in a zombie case, yeah? Yeah. Oh my god, they're gonna think of some kind of creep. Try not to panic. How can I not? They'll definitely have found it. It's game over. 